Hey guys, it's Jamie. So, uh, as you saw in the previous video, we've got a 3D print. And it's pretty light compared to the fully done one. So, uh, I'm going to go over what we need for, for this build. Uh, number one, we're going to need some sort of uh, polyester resin for our fiberglass. Uh, in this case, I'll be using Kevlar uh, for the first coat and then fiberglass for the second coat. Uh, we're going to need some tape. Uh, that's just to tape the edges up and make sure that we don't get anything past the edges and it gets over the side and we have a bunch of problems. Um, a respirator for when we're doing our fiberglassing. That's most important. Safety third, not first. So if it's safety first, then that's the problem. You should be thinking about doing your work, but be safe at the same time. Rubber gloves, obviously, for apparent reasons. Uh, our hardener, uh, some measuring vials. A mixing cup, popsicle sticks, a uh, piece of paper, I can't remember what this is right now, but we're going to toss that aside. Uh, obviously our 3D print that will be coating in resin, both sides, uh, and some magnets. Uh, these will be along, clipped along the inside of here, not here, so that they snap close. So, just like with this one here. stays closed uh, let's see what else are we, we're dealing with oh so uh, you can, as you can see here I've got finger pieces so they go along that with the insets which will be a later video uh, if you want to see about how I made these uh, there's a video that I did uh, it's made with plasti dip and uh, was retweeted by plasti dip people about how to make uh, Halloween parts. So, uh, and then obviously the hinge. This is a airplane hinge for model RC plane, very small. And will allow me to do what I need to do without having a big metal hinge in there. Uh, the, the most important point is the hinge point. Let's see if I can focus in on that. It's very small compared to the outside diameter of, of the actual hinge. And then uh, some petroleum jelly. And what we'll do is we'll take the petroleum jelly, bend the hinge over, rub it in this way along the edges, and then flip it over and do the same thing. So then when we fiberglass the hinge in, it doesn't get stuck and there's fiberglass, or there's uh, petroleum jelly in between there, which acts as a lubricant too. So um, stay tuned guys. I'll be shooting a video on how to start doing this soon and like, subscribe, and share. And as always, do your thing. Thanks for watching.